sino exhortale como a padre a los más jóvenes como a hermanos a las ancianas como a madres a las jovencitas como hermanas con toda pureza Padre te damos gracias en esta preciosa tarde porque hemos sentido hemos, hemos sentido tu presencia por medio de los cánticos hemos sentido tu presencia por medio de las palabras de agradecimiento que tienen los hijos hacia sus madres gracias te damos en esta preciosa tarde por esto Dios mío Padre hermano que he llegado para poder adorar tu nombre te pido que tu paz y carbón encendido por mi labio afina mis oídos para poder oír tu voz llena mi boca tu palabra para poder Dios mío Padre Señor bueno Dios mío Padre sentar esta este palabra que tú me has dado te pido que tú toques los corazones las mentes la conciencia de cada uno de nuestras vidas para poder recibir el mensaje te lo pido en el nombre de Dios amado Jesucristo el cual tiene toda la gloria y honra y el pueblo dice Amén. puede tomar asiento por el tema le he puesto el corazón de una madre el corazón de una madre una vez más felicito a las madres en este día Praise God, aleluya pero yo le quiero preguntar aleluya Praise God, aleluya no te me lo lleves todo un momentito yo me quiero no te lleves todos los hijos todavía Praise God. Go ahead, go ahead. You can take, you can take. I'll use the brothers that are here. Praise God. Amen. Praise God. Kevin, I want you to come up here. Kevin. Praise God, Kevin. Come in. I want to use Kevin first. Praise God. Hallelujah. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say some words, and you're gonna finish the sentence. Okay? You ready? All right. My mother is precious to me, but I love her a lot. Praise God. Give your mama Praise God. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Who else? Who else can I use? Hallelujah. Who else can I use? Amen. Come on, somebody. Come up here. Praise God. Hallelujah. Say something. I'm going to say, okay, you can stand right up there. Stand right there where you at. Right there. Yeah, stand up. My mother is? The best. Praise God. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Anybody else? Anybody else? Christina? Stand up. My mother is? Crazy. No. <laughs> Stephanie. My mother is? Number one. Number one. Number one. Maury. Stand up and say. My mother is? The best. Amen. Macho? My mother is? The bomb. The bomb. Gigi? My mother is? The best. Mm -hmm. Jasmine, my mother is? Wonderful and beautiful. Wonderful and beautiful. Praise God. Hallelujah. Eso es un... Eso es algo pues... Praise God. Tina Marie, my mother is? My friend. Your friend. Praise God. Amen. Praise God. Son cosas, palabras, pues, que podemos expresar de una madre. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. Y yo quisiera poder compartir con ustedes cómo empezó esta celebración. Amen. Cómo empezó yo en mi, en mi edad, praise God, de los últimos uh, de días de mi vida, pues, he sentido, he sentido el anhelo de, de estudiar historia. I don't know why I hated American history when I was in school. Praise God. Social study was one of my worst subjects. But as my age, as my age comes uh, closer to half a century, praise God, hallelujah. Well, praise God, I, I learned to, to love more history for some reason. It's just, I don't know, maybe it's because of the age. Maybe it's slow down, praise God, hallelujah. The history of Mother Day in the rest of the world is a bit different. The U.S., the early English settlers, often disapprove of more secular holidays, and the Mothering Sunday tradition never really took hold. Early attempts to have days to honor mother were mixed with women's suffrage and peace movement and were not very popular. Julia Ward Howe, who wrote the words to Battle Hymn of the Republic. How many people have ever heard of that? Battle Hymn 
of the Republic. Glory, glory, hallelujah. She wrote that song. Praise God. Suggested that the, the idea of the International Mother's Day to celebrate peace and motherhood in, in eight, one, say 18, one, say, uh, wait a minute, 1872. There were many other women who were active with their local group holding annual Mother's Day remembrance. But most were more religious gatherings and not the holiday that we know now. So yo quiero decir en esta, en esta preciosa tarde que la celebración de las Día de la Madre empezó en una iglesia. Eso es lo importante. One of the women who was working on establishing Mother's Day as a national celebration was the mother of Anne Jarvis. Miss Jarvis held an annual gathering, Mother's Friendship Day, to heal the pain of the Civil War. After she died in 1905, Anna, the daughter, campaigned for the establishment of the official Mother's Day to commemorate her mother. Miss Jarvis was a good, as good as her word. She devoted her entire life to struggle to have Mother's Day declare a national holiday in the spring of 1908. Anne wrote to the superintendent of Andrew Methodist Church in Grafton, which is in West Virginia, where her mother had taught Sunday school classes for over 20 years. She requested that the Mother's Day service be held in honor of her mother. Thus, the first official Mother's Day celebration was held at Andrews Methodist Church on May 10, 1908, with 407 persons in attendance. Ann Jarvis sent 500 white carnations to the church in Grafton. One was to be worn by each son and daughter, and two by each mother in attendance. Another service was held in Philadelphia later that afternoon, where Anna's, Anna resided with her brothers. Anna had requested that the first official service in, be held in Grafton, where the Jarvis family had lived so much in their lives, and where her mother had served for so long as a teacher and a public servant. Ann Jarvis campaigned in, this re in the reason we have a formal holiday today. In 1914, President Woodrow Wilson declared that Mother's Day should be celebrated as a national holiday on the second Sunday in May. It didn't take very long for Mother's Day to change from a semi-religious occasion of prayer and peace and appreciation of the work and love of mothers around the world to a gift flower, candy, and dining out extravaganza. Anna Jarvis was actually arrested at the Mother's Day Festival while trying to stop a woman from selling flowers. Jarvis said, I want it to be a day of sentiment and not profit. Mother's Day may not have turned out to be the holiday that Julia Ward Hall how Ann Jarvis and countless other women uh, around where the world would imagine. But it is the celebration of mothers dedicated to the honoring of the woman who gave or gives so much to their families without asking for anything in return. Perhaps every day should be Mother's Day, but most families are too busy with everyday business to say thank you for every meal and every good night kiss. Once every year, the world stops being busy and says thank you with flowers, cards, gifts, and just an outward sign. That was outward sign. What mothers love most is the fact that their families really do notice all that they do. And for one day, every month, uh, every mom is a queen for a day. Today I say to you, Happy Mother's Day. Praise God. La celebración de la Día de las Madres empezó con una mujer 